This world has gone crazy, and there's a lot of fear out there, but there's actually no reason to be fearful. Hey everybody, this is Bill with Live Simple, Live Free, and as I just said, there's a lot of craziness in the world, as we all know, and there's a, it's also bringing about a lot of fear for a lot of people. And as we were in, the, uh, in our worship service uh, the, this week, there was a song that we did that I thought was the message was particularly important for this time that we are living in. And so I really wanted to share it with you as an encouragement because I know it's going to speak to someone today. So the song is called, I'm no longer a slave to fear. I am a child of God. And I know, like I said, it's going to speak to someone. So I want you to listen. I want you to worship with us. I want you to be encouraged. Be blessed in Jesus' name.
this morning, uh, I was singing this song at my house this morning. And throughout the weeks, um, the past weeks, I've just gone through anything, um, trials day after day. I just feel like I'm going through a season of it's something new every single day. And it's hard to cling to my faith. And as I was singing that, um, the Lord just reminded me as I take care of my daughter and I never let her go without, and I'll never let her go without anything she needs. So much more will our Heavenly Father do. He wants to do exceedingly abundantly more than you could ever think for or imagine. You don't even have to ask for it. He knows what you need. He wants to provide for you. He will move heaven and earth for you. And he already is. So as we go back into that bridge, just cling to your faith. Even if you don't feel like it's coming, if you don't have hope that it's coming, just praise your way through it. Praise to the provision because he wants to provide a way for you. For you, you just need to see through it. So let's sing this out again in faith. You split the sea so I could walk around the ruin. My fears are drowned in perfect love. You rescue me so I can stand and sing. I am a child. Sing it out with all your heart. You split the sea. Sing it with your whole heart. Come on, I am a child of God. I'm no longer Declaration. Proclaim it this morning. Remind yourself. Bible says David encouraged himself in the Lord. There's going to be times where you feel discouraged and you feel down and you're going through things. I'm not, that's, that's just a part of reality. But David said, there's, how do I get out of that place of discouragement? How do I get out of that place of brokenness? He encouraged himself in the Lord. One of the best things that we can do in life when we're going through it is to remind ourselves, I am a child of God. I'm going to go through the same things everybody else goes through. I'm going to go through hard times, seasons of loss, seasons of trials, seasons of temptation, battles I'm going to go through, but I'm still a child of God. Jesus said, in this world, you'll have trouble, but be of good cheer. I've overcome the world. And the one that's overcome the world lives inside of us today. I want to say right now, encourage yourself in the Lord. It doesn't mean everything's going to get better. 
It doesn't mean things are just going to change overnight. But remind yourself, I am a child of God. I am going to get through this season. I am going to see better days. The things God has promised me, I will see it come to pass. I am a child of God. I have authority and power by the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah, right now, if you feel that rising, I pray you feel the strength of that. I am a child of God. And that's why Satan, he does this so often. He wants you to question your salvation. He wants you to doubt if you really are God's child because he knows if you're God's child, he can't mess with you. He can't touch you. He can come against you, but he can't mess with you in a way that brings you down and out because you're more than conqueror through him that loves us. Hallelujah. Encourage yourself. God today, God today, Lord, we're hard pressed, Paul said, on every side, but I'm not crushed. I'm persecuted, but I'm not abandoned. I may be struck down, but I am not destroyed. And Father, I pray today, if your people feel that affliction, they feel the, the trials and the struggles, Lord, I pray that they remind themselves, I've been bought with the price, with the precious blood of Jesus. Father, we thank you for that truth today. We thank you for that truth. This week, we're going to go through the same things. We're going to wake up Monday, and it's going to be right there in our face. And I pray that today our people would say, you know what? Tomorrow, I will declare that I'm a child of God. I will declare that I'm victorious. I will encourage myself in the Lord. Give God a great hand clap today if you are his child. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. You can be seated. Man, that was a blessing. Give it up for our worship today. Didn't they do awesome? Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. It's good to see everybody. Thank you for jumping online, those that are um, joining us. We're